Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we're doing part two. We don't know how many parts this is going to be, but today we're doing part two of my closet clean out. So today we're covering one portion of my tops <laughs> and you can kind of see some of my closet in the background here and there will probably be more of a panoramic view too that you'll be able to see how much stuff I have. So I wasn't quite that brutal on my dresses, but we're going to be pretty brutal on the tops today. So tops are going to be hell yes or sell slash donate. So hell yes, or we're getting rid of it because this needs to go, at least the large portion of it. So we're of course going to be trying it on with a dock sandal in lieu of the beautiful weather today. It is 70 degrees outside and we are ready for shorts. We are ready for some skirts. We are ready for some tank tops. So I'm going to show you guys this time directly. I'm going to show you a new pair of dock sandals that I'll be wearing uh, for these outfits today. So this is actually my favorite style of dock sandal. So these are actually the Clarissa 2 quad and they are in black. So there is an original Clarissa that I have um, in black. And I love them. I got them, I think, when they first came out, like three, four years ago. And then I just kept buying multiple different styles because they're honestly the most comfortable and I want to say the hottest stock sandal, I think, out of all the styles. Uh, the fit is just really, really, really good. And they're super comfortable. I wear them all day at work. I work in retail, so you know how important comfortable shoes are. So yeah, I love these. And these have little studs on them. Granted, I could have done that myself, but... At least with Doc, I know they're not going to come off. <laughs> so yeah, these are the sandals we're going to be using to try on all our outfits. And I'm super excited because these are going to be a staple in my wardrobe. So it'll be great to pair all of my tops with this. So yeah, we are going to have some fun today and start trying on all my tops. I'm going to try to move as quickly as I can and talk as little as I can because there's quite a large pile here. Let me show you. That's that's pile number one of the tops we'll be trying on today. We are going to put these sandals on and get started. Uh, this was the first top. I figured I'd just wear it for the video because it's one of my favorite tops. Definitely passes the dock test. I said, hell yes, let's go on to the next one. All right, so this is another express piece and obviously it passes the dock test. Yes, yeah, so this is also a hell yes. All right, so this is Urban Outfitters. Oh, she's a hell yes. I mean, everything about this is a me top. This is a fit that I would wear out to a summer bar night, or maybe if I'm going out with Andrew and we're going out with a bunch of friends or something. It's, an, it's definitely a night fit, but I love how these docks pair with this top, this piece. This, this, I, this is a thrifty piece. Um, I love it. It looks like it was handmade. They do, it does pass the doc test. I think again, the contrast here is phenomenal. And I think we're keeping her. We're keeping her. She's like a yes with wide eyes, but she's not a hell yes. So we're still gonna keep her. It's another thrifted piece. Again, passes the doc test for sure. It's gonna go with a lot and it goes with Doc Martin. So we're keeping her. Okay, I am doing a phenomenal job today with getting rid of my clothes. I am great. We are through about seven or eight pieces already and i've gotten rid of zero i'm not gonna try i'm not even gonna try we're just we're not doing a good job we're not doing a good job it's a one shoulder bodysuit i think it's self-explanatory it's a staple piece it's unique it's edgy it's feminine it could even be chic uh obviously anything black is gonna pass the dock oh so, yeah this is a keep <laughs> Bear with me guys. I promise we're gonna get rid of some stuff. I promise we're gonna get there. This is a velvet black top, okay? Like what is more edgy and feminine and chic than that? Uh, by the way, I'm a big texture person when it comes to clothes. So most things that are velvet, I'm definitely gonna keep. Things that are suede, I'm gonna keep. Things that are leather or even vegan leather, pleather, I will definitely be keeping because they're all edgy, classy, and feminine pieces. Definitely want to keep this baby. Another piece that I'm not going to part with. It passes the doc test. We love her. We love her. We love her. Do you understand now why I love clothes so much? <laughs> they're just so amazing. They just do something for your soul and your mind and the way you feel about yourself. Is this is yellow first of all she's yellow yellow is my favorite color this is a thrifted piece this is a me piece so this is definitely a keep 
am I doing a really bad job? Because I just feel like I'm really bad at this. But it passes the dog test. She's she's gonna stay two. <laughs> I'm not I'm not sure why we're doing this today. I'm feeling a little discouraged because I came into this so gung-ho about getting rid of so many pieces and we're just not doing a good job right now. They're all staples. Obviously, it passes the doc test. How it goes, you know, it passes the doc test. It's a bodysuit and it's a tank. Look at how look at how chic and feminine this piece is. Like I just I I can't. I I need to woosah because trying on my own clothes makes me feel like I'm shopping in my closet and it's making me really excited. And I have this, so um yeah. A girl, a girl gotta love her clothes. You know, you know what I'm saying? She gotta love her clothes, she gotta love her wardrobe. Obviously, a Mickey Mouse baby tee is gonna pass the doc test. She might be the first piece we part with. This is a thrifted shirt. Um, it does have a cute little Mickey print in the back. This is gonna be the first piece we're gonna say goodbye to. This is gonna be going up on my Poshmark. It is super cute, and I actually really like the color and the way it fits, but we gotta get going. This is not a hell yes. I love tops like this. I find them so flattering and thin straps. Love it. Passes the doc test. This is something I could wear every day. So, you know, some people like to drink alcohol. Some people like to gamble. Some people like to <laughs> put all their money into the stock market. Samantha likes clothing. <laughs> this is a hell yes. Very gothic. It passes the doc test. I definitely kept this because I like to wear low-rise denim and this style top is perfect for low rise denim and i love the print on it <laughs> the paisley print i know paisley print had its moment it's definitely a staple piece in my wardrobe it does indeed pass the doc test a thrifted piece it is hell yes it's linen uh, i love thrifting linen it passes the doc test i love the collar on this i love this detail and I love the detail on the buttons. Definitely here for the docks. This is gonna be a get rid of because I can't wear it multiple ways. Cause I feel like if I lift my arms up, I mean, I don't know, I'm trying, I'm really trying here guys. I can't fully lift my arms up. So I think in that light, we're done. Okay, this is too tight around my chest. See, you see what I mean? I don't want this happening. Okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna sell. This is gonna be on my posh work. It's definitely time for this piece to go. I've kept it because it has like that thin striped you know edgy feminine feel but it's the sleeves for me i don't think they do my arms justice and it's just not a piece i've reached for in years oh honey we are not getting rid of this one i got this on sale she's beautiful <laughs> passes the dock test great piece to just wear with anything wear with docks obviously passes the dock test this is a very similar top i really like the buttons what i love about this is i could wear it either way i could wear it facing with the bow out or with the bow in the back. And then the classy V neckline is amazing. It passes the duck test. This is a hell yes. Wait, did I thrift this? I think I did. I thrifted this at Plato's Closet. I don't think anyone's gonna appreciate this striped top more than I do. I just, I, I just, I don't, I don't, I'm not getting that vibe. But I have two other striped tops. But they're not the same stripes. <laughs> oh, we're already 48 minutes into this, guys. This is great. And I've gotten rid of three pieces. Here we have a crop mesh top. <sighs> Obviously it's mesh, it's purple. It's, it's a hell yes. Does it pass the dock test? Yes. Is it a beautiful color? Yes. Do I already have it in a high neck? Yes. It's a hell yes. <laughs> definitely, definitely passes the dock test. So I've kind of noticed that I was drawn to these tops with like the floral prints on them. It is a beautiful top, but it's not really me. I love this little top, it's so cute. This is a hell yes for sure. Obviously passes the dock test. I love this little poof here. It's a little bit, but not too much. I was trying to like create a going out outfit that was made of pajamas because I actually really love that look with a beautiful heel. It is a beautiful color. It passes the dock test. So that's a hell yes, we're keeping that one. So I think I'm gonna keep this one as potentially a going out top, but definitely a night top. <laughs> Left my coffee down there. So. We're gonna drink that, get us a little perked up because we are an hour in, guys. Oh, I love this top. This would be great with low-rise denim. I love, I love vintage pieces because I always feel like they have an edge to them. Partially why I really love thrifting. Definitely passes the dock test. There's no doubt in my mind. We love her. This is also a thrifted piece. I would wear it tucked. It's a little bit boxy. It is velvet. Obviously it passes the dock test. Yes, this is a hell yes. This is another very, very cute piece. It definitely passes the dock test. Q 
cute cut. These are everything. I'm just gonna leave it at that. They're velvet corsets. Anything with boning for me will always be a hell yes. I'm obsessed with this color. By the way, beautiful. This is a beautiful blue. Could not have enough of this color, honestly. Classy, comfortable piece. Go with everything. Why was I drawn to it? Because it's 90s uh, and I love 90s fashion. I'm keeping it. All right, we got a classic bodysuit right here. Sweetheart neckline, this is a hell yes. This is beautiful. Just a classic tank, this is a hell yes. This piece is beautiful and it has this little cross back on it. Or Definitely keeping her. Another sip of my coffee. I know I'm doing this in a white top. This is a hell yes. It's it's beautiful. It's the neckline and I really, really actually like this color. It's like borderline cream beige, but it makes me look really tan and I actually love that. If it doesn't pass the doc test, I would definitely let you all know. Uh, but obviously if, like I said, if I like it and it's a yes for me, it's gonna pass the doc test. And again, let me reiterate for the 25th time, it's highly unlikely that it's not going to pass the doc test if I have it in my wardrobe. Yeah, this, this is a definite yes. Passes the doc test. This piece is a little bit too bleh for me. It's adorable and it reminds me of my mom and I will be getting rid of this one because I really, really like it. It's perfect. It does pass the doc test. And yeah, we're definitely keeping her. Cropped a baby tee. Very 90s. <laughs> Obviously, it passes the doc test. It's just a little crop top um, with a little tie. Passes the doc test. All right, Samantha, it's not a hell yes. So we're changing our mind. We're selling it. All right, we have another thrifted piece. Um, again, this is a definite keep for me. Not this because I really like to wear with overalls. Um, it's a great overall shirt. So yeah, this one I'm definitely keeping. It's a staple in my closet. Kind of coming to the realization that I'm not a cardigan girly. This, this is just not really my jam. Uh, I just wanted to put it on to confirm that. Yeah, this is just gonna get returned. These, and I had not planned on parting with this, but it's a piece that I always try on just to make sure I still like it. But this fit is really, really good. And this color I actually really, really like. Great with the docks, the gray and the black. It has gothic notes to it, which I really, really like. And it obviously passes the doc test. So I definitely want to keep this piece. This is just a basic thrifted tank top. This can definitely go. This is definitely an edgy piece and it is mesh. So I'm pretty sure that's self-explanatory, passes the doc test. This was also thrifted on it's a hell yes. Uh, it's the uniqueness of it. And then like, look at this detail. Like it's just, it's honestly very, very beautiful. I love this. I actually love this top. This is a hell yes. One of those tops I look at and I'm like, eh. And then I put it on and I'm like, this is beautiful. This is a definite yes. Obviously passes the doc test. Fun, super summery. But yeah, and it has little daisies on it. And I just love daisies. That's so cute. Obviously passes the doc test. I really like this top. But yeah, it is very, very pretty. So I'm definitely going to be keeping this one. Tuck this in with some docks. Yes, for sure. Lid here. Yeah, this is a hell yes. This is actually a hell yes. I don't even know why I bother trying this on. Doc test. It's a little too, uh, a little too not me. It doesn't pass the doc test. This one I'm going to be returning. It passes the doc test. And I really like the color and the fit of this. This one is just a really great fit. It only passes the doc test. Again, this is probably the only cow neck piece I will ever own. <laughs> But the fit of this is very, very good. It's just made very well. It is my androgynous piece of the summer. Uh, so it's the fact that I could wear this open with a cute tank and that it definitely passes the dock test. It's the fit. It's just very feminine. And I honestly think it's the detail in the sleeves for me on this one. And I've stopped caring about the hair. So with the docks, definite yes. Again, pardon the hair. We are at the, like I said, three hour point, so. Whatever bun you got here is what you got. This actually might be a little too CEO for me. The color, maybe? I don't know. I thought it was a really nice, like, alt color, but I'm not crazy about it at all. I just love the way this fits, and I love the detailing here. It passes the dock test. It's a definite keep. Like, it's more boxy, which I also like. It's very flowy and effortless, making it chic and feminine. 
so definite keep. It's also very picnic mom. It does definitely pass the doc test. I love these two together. This is a definite keep and it's adorable. Uh, it definitely passes the doc test. It has a little patch. I don't know if this is handmade because it doesn't have a tag, but it has a little patch that says you little heartbreaker you. I don't know if I like how boxy this is. I could do some skin here. It might work, but this is way too big. Look, makes me look way too broad. Also a great low rise top. Um, it does pass the doc test. Uh, the color though, the color washes me out a little bit and I'm not a fan of that. So I think she's going to have to go. The buttons are a little funky because that's how I did it <laughs> and wear it open like this. So yeah, this is a definite keep. Oh no, it still has a lot more life in it. This top's very, very pretty. I don't even, that's a hell yes. Definitely passes the doc test. Definitely keep for me. I actually really, really like this one and it passes the doc test. Keeping this one. Like that is stock approved. It's very pretty, uh, but I think it's lived its life for me. It passes the doc test, but yeah, this is pretty gorgeous. Love this piece and there's a lot I can do with it. Definitely, definitely want to keep this one. It passes the doc test. So I have this one in gold. Depending on the shade of gold, it washes me out a little bit. I think that this might be a return. This color. So yeah, this one's a definite keep. I don't like this because it's super itchy and uncomfortable. I mean, the femininity and the chicness and then the docks are really good with it. So definite yes on this one. All right, so that top, I fixed my hair guys, kind of. So that top was definitely beautiful. Uh, it is a little bit hard to get on, but we're definitely gonna keep her. I love the brown actually. I love it with shorts. Um, It's borderline mom, but it's also kind of chic. Uh, just this contrasting here. I find that very chic and a little bit edgy. I think it's a definite keep actually. And then Tide, which gives that effortless feel. It just changed up the shirt tenfold for me. So this is a hell yes now. But this one feels good. So this one we're definitely keeping. All right, guys, that finally concludes it. Pardon me. I'm still in my strapless bra, uh, but we are done. We got rid of quite a bit of stuff. All this, and then there's another pile of returns slash exchanges I'm going to do. So we got rid of about two piles. I definitely want to make a bigger dent, but it's okay. Thank you guys for coming along. Part three will be up next week sometime. This one should be up at the end of this week. So stay tuned for more footage that involves Doc Martens. All right. Peace out, guys. See you soon.